Hey, we are the Magic Gang from Brighton. And thank you for watching Ambi. Hey everyone, it's Alicia from Ambi, and I'm so excited to be here with the Magic Gang today. Hello oh, everybody. Hey, how's it going? Good. Just thanks for taking the time to do this, and welcome to Canada. No, oh, thank, thank you. you for having us. Yeah. It's my pleasure. So I know you've been in town for a little bit now. Mm. What have you been up to? I heard you were walking up and down Queen Street for a little bit. Yeah, we did the big walk up Queen Street for a while. Yeah, we, um, we've we just eaten loads of food, because yeah. the food here is like 10 really times good. better than in England. So, yeah, and then what else have we done? We've gone to some thrift stores. Um, Met some really nice people. Yeah, yeah. Even the taxi drivers are really nice here. But yeah. And then we played our first show last night at 300 Club. Yeah, awesome. Yeah, no, it's great, really good. What's the best meal you've had so far while here? We went to, um, me and Jack, uh, you had it as well, didn't you, P? We went to Fresca Pizza. Oh, cool. It's oh, yeah. like right next to the 300 Club, and it's like probably the best pizza I've ever had. Really? I'd say, yeah. Nice. They did it properly. It was so good. <laughs> and how about both of you? Me? Yeah. Uh, Food-wise, I had a really nice burrito from a vegetarian place. I f I've forgotten what it was fresh. called. Fresh go. No, no, just fresh. Fresh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Is that, is that something familiar to you? Yeah, right. Yeah. yeah it yeah. was. It was. It was great. Yeah. How about you? Uh, I'll probably go with the pizza as well. Oh wow! All right, yeah, big no, on the pizza good. here. Yeah, 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 it was good. We were told it's the best uh, pizza place yeah. in Toronto, nice. and it lived up to expectations. I'm glad you good. had time to hit it up. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, before coming here, you actually on tour with Vitamin, who we featured a lot on the website. Yeah, yeah. Great band. Yeah. yeah. So, well, what was that tour like? Did you have any standout moments from that? It's really fun. They were just such a lovely like bunch of guys. Like we just, yeah, they, it was just a very like relaxed experience. Everyone was kind of. Very chilled out. It was good. It was really good. Yeah, they're really nice guys. Yeah. yeah, we had so much fun with them. It was quite emotional saying goodbye at the end. And we all like bought each other ice cream. Aw. Yeah. <laughs> it's a nice parting <laughs> gift. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was really nice. Well, I, I think I'm learning magic and really big on food. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, it's following a bit of a theme, this interview. Yeah, yeah, food yeah. thing. Nothing wrong with food. Yeah, food no, and music. It goes hand in hand, <laughs> yeah, right? Yeah, totally. Well, I've been performing your music on this run. You've, of course, been to concerts. So what are some of your favorites that you've been to? What, over here or just in... Just in general. In general. Yeah. We saw um, we saw Whitney in Brighton recently. Well, some of us saw Whitney in Brighton. Yeah, yeah. And Whitney that was, like, amazing. the first show we've been to in a while. Well, like, kind of the first one in a while where it was, like, really, like, kind of quite breathtaking. Like, yeah. really, really good. Like, amazing. We, um, I went to go and see Partner last night at the Silver Dollar, cool. but I heard like pretty bad things about that place. <laughs> so oh, really? Venue. Yeah, apparently it's quite seedy or something. Uh, but I go to shows there all the time. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, I don't know. I mean, it seemed <laughs> fine to me. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> they, were, they were really cool, though. Really cool. Awesome. I went to um, see Unknown Mortal Orchestra. Cool. Um, but I saw them twice in one night. They played uh, in London at Islington Assembly Hall. And then they played like an after show and it was like 150 people there. Wow. And it was just like, yeah. It's an intimate show. Yeah, it was incredible. It was so good. On the I once Go saw Stevie it. Wonder at a festival yeah. in a couple of years ago. And Stevie Wonder is like one of my favorite artists of all time. And that was amazing. Yeah. Awesome. So I didn't really think I'd ever see him, but there you know. On the music front, yeah. <laughs> I, li I like that. Um, on the music front, you dropped your EP back in January, so I think the question on everyone's minds: What's next? Is there an album in the works? What's going no, on? No, we're there? gonna. I think we're gonna put out another EP first. Okay. So we record. We kind of recorded half of that, and then we're gonna go and do the other half in the next couple of weeks, and just hopefully have it out for the summer. I think. So that's kind of the plan. That's where we're at. Yeah, we've started recording it already. Yeah, nice. yeah it sounds great. I think. I think it'll be. Yeah, I think it'll be like a progression, so yeah, it's exciting. <laughs> it feels a lot more like something which is like, uh, that we identify with on a personal level, as well as like music, I, I don't know. It's like, we're like really into it. Like It's pretty, yeah, it's pretty like fresh in terms of like, we've just written the, the songs, so it's kind of like, a, quite a good representation of where we want to go with, with it, because it's like new, they're new songs to us. So yeah. that's really, that's always like really exciting. Well, it's an exciting moment when you're in the studio together and you look at one yeah. another and you're like, that sounded good. Like, yeah, yeah. That moment definitely. clicked yeah, for yeah. us. Yeah. Well, this sure. from from the past EP, uh, for me, when I listened to She Doesn't See, I just loved like how bubbly the bass line was and oh. like, it was just a, a catchy melody. Cool. So why don't you just tell me a little bit more about that track? Well, we recorded that in Jamaica, actually. Yeah. <laughs> hey, everybody. We recorded that in Jamaica. <laughs> 
Don't worry, it's fine. It's fine, don't, don't worry. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, we recorded that song in Jamaica. Uh, sounds made up. Yeah, yeah, it does sound made up, yeah. Um, yeah, in Jamaica. Yeah, I don't know, that's a really old song. Yeah. Um, so I don't really even remember yeah. like how it was written or whatever, but it's just really fun to play live mm -hmm. and like people like love singing along and yeah, it's a really good one to <laughs> yeah. It's a fan favorite, I guess. And after CMW, you have some pretty big festivals coming up. Yeah, Latitude yeah, that's right. and Reading. Yeah. That's yeah. amazing. Congrats on Thank you, Thank you very much. Yeah. yeah, you're welcome. So if you could curate your own festival though, which bands would you love to see on that? Just so we could get a little taste of who you're digging lately. I'd like to see Love on it. The yeah. 60s band. Yeah, I think Carol King. She's yeah. playing. She's playing Hyde Park in London this summer. So maybe we might have the chance to go and see her. But yeah, I don't what know. from any era or like yeah, anything? Beach Boys. Nice. Yeah. The Beatles. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, Balkans. Obviously. Yeah, Balkans. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, yeah, Balkans. That band from Atlanta. Cool. They did like one record and like it's probably like one of our favorite collectively like one of the records that we all like probably love mm. like yeah we probably have to get someone weird in there as well so like maybe um i don't know bob marley should play as well yeah probably we have bob marley <laughs> relatively high up yeah yeah probably like headliner maybe <laughs> <laughs> yeah. he's like sure yeah. Yeah, that works so we'll see if he's up for it yeah, yeah we'll have to, it's yeah. like you're That's interviewing real. him <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah how do you feel about getting bob marley <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> Cool. Um. <laughs> Sounds like a good lineup. Too. Yeah, 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 it's gonna be, yeah. it's gonna be great. Like I think we need to, to work on it a little bit, but, yeah. we, but it's almost there. The bass is sounding pretty good. Yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. <laughs> to wrap things up today, is there anything you want to say to all of your fans who are gonna be viewing the interview? Uh, uh, live long and prosper. Um, is it, have, you, have you got? No. Paris, <laughs> <laughs> have you got anything to say to our fans? <laughs> <laughs> um, Hi, and thank you. <laughs> I would say, uh, keep it up. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Keep keep supporting us, please. Thank you. Um, also, yeah, life is short, so make sure you spend every moment doing something you love or trying to. I don't think I can top any of those. No, I think so. that was really good. Yeah. Those were some far right <laughs> ones. Yeah, yeah. I just want to add to that. Keep supporting them. We have been featuring you. It feels like forever since yeah. you started. Yeah, yeah. So I just want to say thank, thank you so, so much. much for your time. Thank, thank you, you for supporting us. us. My pleasure. Yeah. And remember to everybody viewing, you can visit us at musicblogia.com for exclusive interviews, features, videos, and so much more with your favorite bands. See you next time. Cool. cool.